Meanwhile, South Korea's intelligence agency says North Korean leader Kim Jong-un fears for his own personal safety and is taking measures to protect himself. This as the regime continues to pour hundreds of millions of dollars into developing missiles and nuclear weapons. Kwon Suwa has the details. This year's parliamentary audit into South Korea's intelligence agency has unveiled new information about the North Korean regime. At a closed-door session held on Wednesday at the National Intelligence Service headquarters, the agency's head, Lee Byung-ho, indicated that there is growing instability within the reclusive state. He said that North Koreans' disillusionment with their leadership has worsened and that the number of defectors who entered the South increased by 20 percent this year compared to the year before. Furthermore, North Korea's leader Kim Jong-un seems to be going through health issues with cardiovascular conditions suspected of getting worse due to his heavy drinking and overeating. Addressing concerns over his weakening power grip, Kim is said to have heightened security measures, enforcing systems that detect explosive and toxic substances. Also, Kim is reportedly changing his scheduled public appearances frequently due to anxiety. Regarding North Korea's continual attacks on the South, the intelligence chief revealed that roughly 200 million U.S. dollars had been invested into nuclear and missile development programs this year. He also noted that the number of cyber attacks have been on the rise more than twice the annual average over the past three years. Security firms and internet banking software are being targeted continuously, and South Koreans are being scammed on gambling websites run by the North. Kwon Soa, Arirang News.